Hi, everyone. I'm Lisa Copeland, love coach and dating expert for women over 50. And today I want to talk about a really important topic. It's about bad boys and why they don't make good boyfriends. And I'm going to give you three reasons why you really want to stay away from them. You know, everyone loves a bad boy, yet most of them make terrible boyfriends. And why? Well, the first reason is he makes you feel alive inside. And that's part of why you're so wildly attracted to him. And the reason for that is bad boys have this innate understanding of women. They know exactly what to say that makes you literally fall head over heels for them. A bad boy is the kind of man who's going to tell you things like they broke the mold when they made you, or there's no one else he can trust to share his deepest thoughts with other than you. The second reason you want to stay away from a bad boy is the chemistry with a bad boy is off the charts. But bad boys are fun, and the language they speak can create unbelievable chemistry between the two of you. But the problem is his words are rarely followed up with action. He, it's why he can tell you on a Saturday night that he loves you, yet Sunday morning he's disappeared. The third reason you don't want to get involved with the bad boy is a bad boy can't make a commitment to you or to any other woman. He loves going after the prize, and that is the one woman he wants and desires in the moment. Hear me when I say in the moment. He'll do everything in that moment to get you into his life. But sadly, once the chase is over, he tires of you and he starts the hunt for someone new. The chase, his words, and his charm are what are making you fall in love with him. And when he stops all contact, it can break your heart. What's even worse is a bad boy can come back to you when he's between women, telling you how much he's missed you. And guess what? You fall in love with him all over again, thinking he's going to be back for good this time, but he's not. He just doesn't want to be alone while he's looking for his next conquest. A bad boy is going to continue to come in and out of your life until you set a boundary and you decide you've had enough with having your heart broken and want to put a stop to this heartbreaking cycle. This is what happened to my client, Cindy, who was going through her second divorce when her high school boyfriend popped back into her life. They didn't live in the same city, but that didn't stop them from spending every night on the phone or on FaceTime talking for hours. Cindy's old boyfriend would paint romantic scenarios, telling her how he never stopped loving her and how he, unlike her second husband, who she was in the process of divorcing, he would have put her on a pedestal and never let her go if they'd been together. Listening to his words, she found herself falling in love with him. Then out of nowhere, the phone call stopped. He vanished and her heart was broken. She tried texting him and calling him to see if he was okay, but he would ignore her attempts to reach out to him. What happened was she began second guessing herself, wondering what she'd done to chase him away. The thing is, Cindy did nothing wrong. Her bad boy just moved on to his next conquest. And then one day out of the blue, he called her totally out of nowhere. And she told me how excited she felt hearing his voice again. His hollow words pulled her right back in, thinking this would be the time he'd stay. Did he? No, of course not. It was only a matter of time before he vanished again. And the cycle happened over and over again until she realized she'd had enough. That's when she came to me. She decided it was time to attract a man into her life who would capture her heart and do everything in his power to keep it. Together, we created what I create with every client, a quality man template, also known as a QMT. This is a tool that helps you get a clear vision of the right man for you. It starts with getting clarity on your old type 
it's likely you'll keep attracting the wrong type of man over and over again if you don't do this step. Something Cindy realized about bad boys when she graded her quality man template. And it turns out her high school flame was one of the many bad boys she'd been attracting into her life for years. Next, you wanna do a deep dive into what in a man is gonna make you happy. What do you really want now at this time in your life versus when you were 20? Which by the way is how many women choose men from the qualities and the deal breakers they used when they were so much younger. When you have a clear vision of who you want, it opens the possibilities for seeing men you might have passed over who could actually be a good match for you. This is one of the reasons women get so frustrated with matchmakers. He or she can see the possibilities for you, but you can't because you're still looking for your old type. It's also why you might have a hard time seeing men online who could be a great match as well. Here's what I mean. My client Mindy is now happily in a seven month relationship with a man that is different than any man she ever dated since her divorce. The reason why? He checks all the boxes off on her quality man template. Another client of mine, Mary Ann, would have passed up her guy if she hadn't had a quality man template. Today, she's happily in a successful relationship and feels like her quality man template helped her finally choose the right man to share her life with. Audrey, another client of mine, was always attracting the wrong types of men who never wanted to commit to a relationship. Her quality man template made her realize what she needed to focus on to get what she wanted a good committed man in her life. She met a caring man who shared her values and had the biggest loving heart. And more importantly, he fit everything on her quality man template, but she never would have seen him before. Allison met a really great guy and is having the time of her life. She feels like her quality man template told the universe precisely what she wanted and bam, he appeared. If the idea of getting the right man to show up in your life excites you and you're ready to have an honest conversation about how that can happen for you, let's talk in a complimentary session together. Just click the link below and it's gonna take you to a quick application form. It's very quick and easy. I just need to know what you're doing in your love life, who you're looking for and what you wanna accomplish. If I think I can help you, I'll send you a link to my calendar to set up a time for us to talk. If I feel we're not a fit, I'll give you some resources I believe can help you on this journey. That's it. If you feel like this is the right opportunity for you, just click the link below to get started. You can find love after 50. You just have to be able to see the guy and chances are right now you can't. And I'd love to help you do that. Believing in you, big hugs to you.